Alright, today I'm going to do a review of Jack in the Boxes, um, what's it called? The Large Bacon Ranch Combo Frisco Burger thing, I don't know, with curly fries and a large Coke uh, sourdough, I think it's what it is. So we got our curly fries, big old uh, thing of them, whatever it's called. And then the burger itself, a couple fries in the bottom. Oh, and of course, no straw. That's great. So I guess I'll have to scrounge one up somewhere. So anyway, we'll open this up real quick. Get a quick glimpse of it. There we go. Yeah, not too bad looking. I have to do a comparison of what it looks like on the website. Uh, that's not bad. Lettuce, tomato, uh, bacon, cheese, the burger, and the ranch. So, yeah, let me see what it looks like on the on the website for a comparison. Well, they don't seem to have it on here on the website. It's just the sourdough jack and the spicy uh, sriracha burger. Huh. Boy, that was loaded with jalapenos. That's something maybe for another day. Okay, there's my straw. I actually had a, an extra from who knows where. So, price for this, uh, let's see, five eighty-eight, and then come all the way down here. There's your tax, fifty-three cents. So six forty-one for this super-sized combo. Uh, extra large curly fries, the bacon ranch sourdough burger, and the extra large Coke. So, yeah. So now I'll go ahead and, uh, yeah, we'll go ahead and open this up. Yeah, there's your ranch on that side. And again, not easy to do with one hand. Yeah, there we go. In fact, I'll just flip it over right there. There we go. Lettuce, tomatoes, mayonnaise, bacon, cheese. So, yeah, doesn't look too bad. So now, I guess I'll let you watch me eat it. <laughs> All right. Uh. Oh yeah, and my Star Wars style Space Invaders shirt. <laughs> I got a bunch of these weird shirts I'll wear periodically for these videos, so <laughs> something different. All right, let's see how this tastes. Cause actually, I've never had this before, and uh, but I do like bacon and ranch. So, yep, lettuce falling off already. So, great. All right. Yeah, it's not bad. Move that out of the way. Yeah, the burgers cooked well done, which is good. Yeah, the ranch really does, really does taste good. I don't know if that's mayonnaise or ranch. Maybe it's, you know, both on one side or the other. I can't really tell. Hmm, looking at the receipt. <clears throat> you take our survey, you get two free tacos. Ooh, <laughs> what a deal. Yeah, this is actually pretty good. Actually, have a pretty good selection. Both 
Burger King and Jack in the Box got a good selection of uh, burgers. So, yeah, I'll probably sample each of them over time. Hmm. And of course your curly fries. Bit greasy but good. Yeah, that's a big coat. <clears throat> All right, well, yeah, that was, uh, yeah, that was quite tasty. I recommend that for sure. Um, not too greasy, you know, I mean, and yet, you know, there's those burgers, I think actually Hardee's, <clears throat> some of those big Angus burgers, man, you can just taste the grease on them, and sometimes that's just like, that's not for me, but still, I mean, they're good, you know, but you can't really taste too much grease on those, so, yeah, um, yeah, they got the regular burgers and the, the chicken sandwich variety, so, yeah, like I said, I'll be te testing or sampling those, doing a review of them over time, so, as for now, yeah, that's pretty much it for the Frisco Bacon Ranch uh, Sourdough Burger. I'm going to go ahead and munch on my curly fries now, which, uh, you know, I'm sure you don't want to see me eat them all, but, you know, <laughs> they're still pretty good. So, yeah, now if you're hungry, you know, about lunchtime or even dinner, you know, I recommend this one. So, have at it, and, uh, yeah, stay tuned for the next food review whenever that is, and uh, we'll just pick something at random, or if you guys have suggestions. I know a few of you have recommended, you know, different uh, types of uh, burgers and meals, you know, selections from the different fast food restaurants. So, yeah, keep those coming, and I'll make notes of them, and we will do reviews of them in the near future. So, stay tuned for more, and thanks for watching.